You've seen smartphones. You've seen smart watches. Well, today at IFA 2018, I got to see, well, something in between. Right away, I gotta fess up, folks. This video is gonna be light on details. This thing is so early that the people who built it didn't even let me touch it. Those people are the crew at Nubia, a technology company spun off from ZTE a few years ago. That's important because it's a legit manufacturer, which isn't always guaranteed at a trade show where vaporware is as common as actual products. If this thing, which is called the Alpha, by the way, had borne a brand I'd never heard of, I probably never would have pointed a camera at it. Because while Nubia's press renders paint a rosy picture of a sleek bit of kit, the prototype on display had some um, rough edges. Nonetheless, Nubia says it wants to get this thing on the market by holiday 2018. So, what have we got? Well, a wraparound OLED display, Nubia wouldn't say who built it, but it's probably LG or Samsung, featuring a heavily customized build of Android. Nubia wouldn't say which version. There's a 4G radio inside, so you can make and take calls with the embedded speaker, a camera, if you want to make those calls over video, a sensor to tell it which way is up, so you can wear it on either wrist, and of course an LTE modem for data surfing, so you can, I don't know, watch Instagram TV. The demo loop on the floor model showcased much more common smartwatch functions like exercise timers and music players and the like, which of course begs the question, why buy this instead of just a regular smartwatch? Scanning the company's official release gets you a bunch of fluff that doesn't say much, and asking for more concrete pricing details got me the same lack of answers. So what are we left with? Well, not so much a product that I'm dying to review in the sense that I'll tell you whether or not you should buy it. Honestly, I doubt I'd say you should. But you know, that's not the only reason I do these videos. I mean, this right here is one of the great reasons to come out to a trade show. You get to see concept models, companies saying, hey, you know what? This might be crazy, but we have the ability to build it and we're bored with the status quo. So here, maybe this is the future. What do you think? And even though this particular vision of the future sort of fizzled when Samsung pitched it a few years back, and this seems more like a publicity play than anything else, well, I'm just glad there are companies out there still willing to surprise us every now and then. This video was brought to you by Thrifter, a new way to save money on everything from gadgets to home goods by shopping based on value and not hype. Check out the latest deals at thrifter.com and tell them Mr. Mobile sent you. What do you think of the Nubia Alpha? Is this the future or should it be left in the past? Drop a line in the comments and let me know. And be sure you're subscribed to The Mr. Mobile on YouTube in case I do end up trying this thing out in the real world someday. Until next time, thanks for watching and stay mobile, my friends.